Welcome to Advanced Construction Videos, where we show you how to tackle rocketry building techniques and more. On our website, we sell kits, motors, building supplies, and electronics. So come and learn, shop, build, and fly when you visit us at ApogeeRockets.com. In this step, we need to um, sand these edges to make them a little bit smoother than what they were from the rough cut. Um, as they're laying on the tube right now, um, you can see my marker here. Um, they don't look very straight, and so we're going to try to straighten those out a little bit. If it's not perfect, don't worry. Later we can come back and we can put a fillet on there and make it blend in perfectly smooth. So right now we're just trying to, um, trying to reduce the amount of work that we'll have to do later. Um, so to sand these, uh, we want to do two things. First we want to sand this edge a little bit more. And then we also want to sand this edge. Um, I'll start by doing this edge. Um, and this helps to have a long sanding tee. You could do it on, on, on paper or sandpaper on the table as well, like this. Um, but it's, it's just a little easier to hold it. And I'm just trying to smooth it out, make it you know, knock off any of the high spots. That's a, a little bit better fit. And now we're going to do this back edge right here. Uh, mostly it's the corners uh, from when we did around the tube. For that, we're going to take a piece of sandpaper, wrap it around the tube like this. And we're just going to sand back and forth. Try to get it to conform a little bit nicer to the tube so that we don't have to fill as much later. Okay, so you can see the technique on that. Usually leave a little burr on there. Just knock that off. Like that. Okay, so we're going to do the same technique to the little piece right here, the canopy. This one's a little harder to hold, um, so you have to you know, kind of go back and forth. And then we'll do the edges as well. And then finally the canopy here. Okay, so now this one we're going to use the nose cone. So I'm going to wrap it around the, the nose cone like this and then sand that. And then when we're done, it should lay really nice along that nose cone. You can see my ink, but actually the edge looks pretty good there. So I got one more fairing to do um, and I'll go ahead and do that and then we'll get ready for the next step.